we often hear the terms computer worm, virus and trojan. What are they? How are they different from each other? In this video, we would try to understand that. Worms, viruses and trojans are types of malware. The term malware refers to malicious software that is intentionally designed to cause damage to computers, servers or computer networks. There are several types of malware. Worms, viruses and trojans are some types of malware. A computer worm is a standalone program. It exploits security vulnerabilities of a system to infect a system and after infecting a computer, it uses the infected computer as a host and scans and infects other computers of the network. As I said, a computer worm is a standalone program. It does not need to attach itself to an existing program. A computer worm is instead an independent program or code chunk. After infecting a computer, it uses recursive methods to replicate itself without a host program and spreads to other computers using a computer network. A computer virus on the other hand attaches itself to an existing program and self replicates to infect other computers. A computer virus is not a standalone program. It can reside in a binary executable data file or the boot sector of a host hard drive. A computer virus may use various social engineering techniques and exploit security vulnerabilities of a system to infect the system. For example, a virus can be written in a macro language and it can attach itself to a document. The attackers can then send a phishing email to a victim with a malicious attachment. When the victim opens the document, the virus code gets executed and infects the victim's computer. The term computer trojan is derived from the term trojan horse of the ancient Greek story. A computer trojan uses various social engineering techniques to infect a computer and hence the name. Much like a computer virus, a computer trojan exploits security vulnerabilities of a computer to infect the computer. But unlike a computer virus, a computer trojan does not need to attach itself to an existing program. It also does not try to self-replicate to infect other computers in the network. A trojan often misrepresents itself to appear useful or interesting to a user and uses social engineering techniques to deceive the user into downloading and installing the malware. For example, a Trojan can misrepresent itself on an unsafe website as antivirus software and when a user clicks on it and downloads the software, the Trojan may infect the user's computer silently. After that, the Trojan may steal sensitive data of the victim, corrupt data or hard drive, format disks, infect the master boot record of the computer or even encrypt the hard drive to extort money from the victim. To summarize, these are the differences between a computer worm, virus and Trojan. How to prevent computer worms, viruses and trojans? Do not click on suspicious links. Do not open attachments of emails sent by unknown senders. Do not download software from untrusted sources. Keep your operating system, browser and other commonly used software updated with recent patches. More updated software is lesser are its known security vulnerabilities. Configure a proper firewall on your computer and last but not least, take regular backups of your important data. I hope this helps. Interested viewers who want to know more can visit the website of the security buddy. The relevant links are provided in the description. You can also subscribe to us and get notifications on recent videos.